All right, in this video, we're going to take a look at developing the movable jaw plate. Pretty simple, base extrusion here. You can see we have symmetry where we have two hole wizard holes. So let's go ahead and take a look at how we're going to develop this one. So let's start the mo movable jaw plate by selecting the front plane and creating a new sketch. I'll go ahead and set up a center line through the origin. And now I'm going to create a rectangle. And again, what we could do here is we can right click over the bottom line and select midpoint, then control click the origin and use coincident to center our rectangular sketch there. Now we'll go ahead and use our smart dimension. We'll establish the total width here of 2.450. And then we've got an overall height of 1.50. And then we'll go to extrude boss. We'll extrude towards the back and we'll make this 0.300 in depth. Now, all we need to do is set up our whole wizard holes here, and we have two 10, 32 um, holes. So let's go ahead and select whole wizard here. And we're going to do a straight tap. We'll do our 10, 32, and we'll go up to surface. And again, we, we're using cosmetic thread with the thread call out. And we'll select the back face here as the face to extrude two. Okay. So now when we go over to positions, we're going to do this a little bit differently. First, I'm going to select the front face to orient the holes. Then I'll just go ahead and place the holes. Now, you can see if you right click and go to select, you can also use smart dimension without the use of other sketch circles. And we can simply dimension to our points. So here we have 0 0.750. We'll do the same thing for the second one here. So 0 0.750. And then we have from the center, or the origin in this case, we have a dimension of 0 0.780. We'll do the same thing to this point. So that would be another way that we can place our whole wizard holes without the need for other sketch geometry. Just simply place it on the face and then use smart dimensions to locate the holes. All right, now you can Specify the material and prepare the technical drawing for the movable jaw plate.